Let's take a look. Okay, now for the um, snip, snip, snip changes. Not snip, snip, snip. Mix, mix, mix. I, in the over 700 hours I have played this game since launch, have never been able to do that consistently. Ever. Ever, 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 ever. It's a lot easier now. A lot easier to do that now. And because it's a lot easier, you get more reward from it because you can do it more often. Yep, you see? That is so much easier, and that cost me no meter. No meter. Usually, after I got the mixed cross up, I would RC there and convert, but now I don't have to, so. You could already do this if you were, like, better than I am, basically. You, were, you had better inputs than I did, but this is a lot easier now. If you struggled with this like I did, be able to do this more easily and get bigger combos, so you get a higher average damage output. Really nice change. It also strengthens the mix up game for me uh, in this situation because, again, I couldn't get this reliably. And now that I can, the cross up is a lot more scary because of it. Before, that would cost me a bar of meter. Now it doesn't. That is very good for me. Really, really good. I'm super happy about that. Super happy about it. Lovely change. Oh, I, I, can't, I cannot put into words just how much this is going to improve my game. I have an actual terrifying cross-up now. Hang on. That actually works. Okay, yes. <laughs> Will this wall break? Please tell me the super now wall breaks. Oh, yes. That's nice. Did that do less damage? I don't know. I uh, can't remember what the last one did. That might have done less damage, but because it's a wall break super, you get the hard knockdown, so it's probably better overall in terms of, like, uh, wall break positioning. It makes it better after you've wall broken. But, yeah, I can do that consistently now. That is so nice, so nice. I've also been messing around with different combos and I can tell you that the, uh, you know, when you hit with like the backside of Mix 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 and it launches them the wrong way, that barely ever happens now. It always launches them into the, uh, into Faust. So if you're in the corner and say they bounce off the wall and they land behind you and they hit, they're hit by the backside of Mix Mix Mix, it will throw them into you or maybe even through you back into the corner. So I haven't got any um, demonstrations of that. Anyway, hang on, let's see if I can set one up. Right, you see there? You see how Mix 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 hit on the wrong side? Normally that would have threw them away from me backwards, but it didn't, it threw them into me. So I was able to get a mix loop there where normally I wouldn't have been able to. And obviously I was able to combo into Trumpet Wave, so... You saw the combo earlier where I showed this, but even if this screws up and you accidentally do Mix 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 too fast and you end up on the wrong side, you can actually still convert from it, which is really nice, really nice change. I love it. Mix Mix Mix, at least my early impressions of it, seems to be a lot more consistent than what it has been in the past, and it's going to massively help out Faust. I'm not going to drop my combos as often. I'm not going to get punished as often. I'm going to get bigger com uh, English. Bigger combos than what I previously were able to get because of, you know, cross-up mix loops being easier. I don't know if I can do it. Let's see. Nope. Alright, see that there? That, like, cross-up there? Uh, I'm really bad at it, but uh, if, um... Nope. First try. First try. First try on the cross-up. Yeah, I mocked up the initial mix, but the second one is absolutely 
it's so easy. You just basically hold whatever direction you're facing in. So if I'm like heading this way, right? I just hold three and if I'm on the other side, I get a mixed loop. It's so easy, so easy. Once I get the timing down on the, uh, that, that bit, the first one. Crap. Yeah, see? Once you get the tricky bit down, the first bit, the second bit is easier. Before, the first bit was really hard because of the, like, the timing, and the second bit was just as hard. And for me personally, it was damn near impossible. But now it's actually... I, I can... It, the second bit's super consistent. I just need my execution to be better to get the first one. Yeah. Yeah, that's, that's so much easier. So much easier. I love this change. Love it so much. Okay, I've done a little bit more testing on the Mix 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 uh, stuff, and again, it feels like it works in conjunction with Scarecrow now. So you can do something like this. Right? And he's set to mash 5p on Wake Up, and that beat the 5p. So you can get some pretty cool stuff from this. So you can do stuff like that now, which is uh, really cool. Before this was never possible, but due to the increased startup, oh sorry, reduced startup on the Scarecrow, it's possible now. Yeah, so either side, you can do some nutty stuff. If you do fast RC there as well, you can probably get similar combos, but for less meter. Yep, so that's the fast RC version. It costs 80% of one bar rather than a full bar. So you do save a little bit of meter on that one. So now you can use Scarecrow and Mix 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 in conjunction with one another for mix-up opportunities that do pretty damn decent damage if they work. Also, keep in mind, if he wants to do like a wake up invulnerable option, like a DP or invulnerable super, he'll have to change his inputs to match whatever version of Scarecrow I'm doing. If he inputs the wrong side, it won't work and then I get a hit. So this is legit a 50-50. He has to just guess. I guess Leo might be able to get out of this with his um, his DP, but pretty much everybody else has to guess what side you're going to show up. Very nice. So yeah, not only is Mix 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 being improved, but it now has the ability to be used in conjunction with Scarecrow far more often, where before you always had to like PRC Scarecrow to do stuff with it. So yeah, I'm really liking this change. Faust's special moves and his normals and his items now actually feel like they work in conjunction with one another rather than against each other, like they sometimes felt. So because of this, I feel like Faust has a lot more creativity as to how he uses his options since they work together better now. And it just feels so good. It feels so good having normals and specials and items that you can actually use in conjunction with one another you could do stuff like this before but it wasn't to the same degree it feels like the versatility now is just significantly better